Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to reset Wix website to start over. Before we start, hurry up and check out the self just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering how do you reset Wix website here to start over. So in this case, if you made some changes here and you want to basically have a fresh start on your already existing website here, there's a few things you need to do. So first is we need to go ahead and basically access our dashboard. So currently I am in my editor here. So let's go ahead and go to site at the top left here and you want to go to my dashboard. Now, if you're already on your dashboard here, good for you. So because in this case, we just need to access our settings. So in this case, at the bottom left here in the left panel, you want to click on settings and other settings. You want to scroll down a bit here and you want to look for the option for our uh, in this case, our site history. So usually you should be able to find it under website settings here. And again, scroll down a bit until you see the site history here. Let's go ahead and click under store versions. Now, the thing here is you have the option to view a few things like different versions of your website. So in this case, if you want to view a specific version of your website, you can go ahead and click on the arrow here, which in this case, click to view the save version of your site. So if you want to free view it. So in this case, once you click on it, you have the option to restore it if you want to. Now, if you're worried that, for example, if you restore this specific version of your website here, you might be worried, hey, my may uh can in this case my if my data can be lost whenever you uh, restore your version here. So the thing here is if you have like CMS in your website or in your Wix website here, it will not affect whenever you are storing something on your uh, Wix website. It will still uh keep the content you already have. So in this case, if we if we want to restore that, click on restore here. And from here, just click on restore. So in this case, uh, you could go ahead and basically continue editing your website here. And if you're ready to go live to publish your website. Now, by the way, if you restore your website here, make sure that the editors that you have here are actually closed. Because in this case, this will actually affect the look of your website. Again, close any editors. Make sure to notify all your developers if you have our core developers in your website here. Just to notify them, hey, I'm uh reverting some changes here i'm going to store it in a previous version so make sure to close it but then again once you've done that or once you've closed that restore it restore it via this page here and you should be good so just a quick warning here so if you have like for example if you have a specific plan already for your wix, web wix website here so i would suggest you to uh basically uh first contact support because sometimes when you whenever you revert to a specific version here that in, in this case, you haven't unlocked the premium version or you haven't upgraded your website at that specific moment, you might lose your premium. So some users actually reported that. So make sure to reach out to support if you uh, if that specific version that you're trying to recover already uh, doesn't have like the premium yet. So in this case, again, you need assistance from support if that's the case. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.